is to baptize in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Be baptized in Jesus' name. Hey guys, it's your girl Joyce aka Joe Benji back again with another video. I know it's been a while since I last posted, but I wanted to get on here and just give you guys a update on you know what's been going on and where I've been because I know you can tell by the thumbnail a lot has changed. I think we can all agree when I say that life has its fair share of ups and downs and when you're down sometimes you forget what it's like to be up and when you're up you're praying to God to never be down again. After taking a break from YouTube, it's definitely felt like a roller coaster ride for me. A series of ups and downs. I threw myself into some incredible new adventures. I traveled. I started an Airbnb and Toro business. And all the while, I kept my e commerce brand growing strong. But as life would have it, I faced a major setback. Something happened to my inventory that caused a huge loss. Balancing everything was definitely a challenge, but by the grace of God, I managed to navigate through it all and make it work. Then, life took a surprising turn. I became a mom. You can't see where I'm sitting, though. Well, it's a girl. It's a what? A girl. Okay. What do you think? So good. Okay. What you think? <laughs> <laughs> it is. Hmm? I think it's a boy. Boy, boy, boy. But during my pregnancy, I had to make the tough decision of removing myself from a relationship that wasn't so ideal for me and focus on the happiness and the health of my baby. I turned to spending time with family and friends, doing DIY projects, and just getting myself into a whole bunch of hobbies to keep myself busy. It's not easy when there's a lot of things that are going on that feels like your life is just crumbling all around you. But I'm happy that I focused on the positive habits and positive activities to keep myself creative in a time where I didn't know what life was gonna be like. But I can say that truly what helped me was focusing on God and trusting in his plan for my life and not allowing the things that were going on around me to dictate my future. In this season of my life, I've learned to surrender it all to God. Because as an entrepreneur, you get so used to doing things on your own and having a plan and just sticking to that plan. And when things don't go right, it's like we lose our minds, you know? But I learned that in this season in my life, I had to surrender it. And moving forward, I just have to learn to surrender my plans to God. And in order for him to come into my life and my situation, I have to step out of the way. And by doing so, I focused on the good. And then eventually the good got better. I've never experienced such beauty and chaos. And if you ask me if I go back and do anything differently, I'd say no. I am where I need to be and everything that has happened is working for my good. Juggling parenting as a single mother, running a business as an entrepreneur, and overcoming setbacks has been tough, but I'm doing my best to balance it all. There are definitely days when it feels overwhelming, but my son and my faith have taught me so much about love and resilience. 
I'm back now and I'm ready to dive into creating content and sharing my journey with you all. Here's to new beginnings and everything that's ahead. Thanks for being a part of my story. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of the new content coming your way. See you in the next video. Thank you.